Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Majora's Mask. Let me actually pick up my uh, controller here. <laughs> Alright. So we're going to want to have to go back to the entrance room. I am back from a, a good kind of long break. About an hour. I went ahead and ate some lunch. It was 2 o'clock. Probably should have eaten it earlier. I had some ramen and uh, some strawberries. It was a very interesting dinner, or lunch, excuse me. All right, we can go ahead and break this one. We already have a door into it over there, but we can also break this one. This goes to the same room, but it doesn't matter. And I also have had a little bit of time looking for some stuff so I can get a job. Basically, what's been going on today is, uh, I, I went to an interview, and I was really looking forward to this interview, and I went there, and they're like, can you work from, like, at 5 o'clock in the morning? I'm like, sure, as long as I get a job. I didn't say that, but I'm like, yeah, absolutely. They're like, great, you're hired. I'm like, oh, okay, amazing, because literally nobody has given me the time of day. I've applied to, like, 15 places, gotten two interviews, one interview went relatively poorly, and this is the other one. So I went today, and I'm like, great, come over here. So I did, and they're like, all right, so uh, give me your give me your um, social security card and your driver's license. And I'm like, well, I was told last night by my mother, <laughs> I didn't actually, I, I was like, I, I, w I didn't think I needed a social security card, and I cannot find mine. Because, like, mom was like, hey, do you have your social security card? I'm like, no. And she's like, it should be in your wallet. I'm like, you have never given me this card. I have never seen this card. I didn't even know it existed. Because I've never gotten a job before. This would be my first job. So, she's like, oh, okay, well, I don't think you need it anyway. And she just, you know, that's it. That was the end of the discussion. So I was like, oh, well, alright then, sure. Apparently I do. And, uh, the... I need two government IDs in order to apply to a job. I didn't know this fact. So, I look like an idiot to this guy, and I don't have a way to apply to the job. And they're like, well, it takes like 10 days for you to get a new ID. So obviously, they don't really like the idea of me wait of waiting to hire me for 10 days if I'm just some schmuck who's going to be like, just mopping the floor at five o'clock in the morning. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, we gotta get over there. So, uh... Let's go in this way. So, I'm a little bit upset, and I have to find... A, I We can't find my birth certificate either. That would be another good one. But that one doesn't exist either. So, oh! I uh, guess we got nothing. So, we have to look like freaking obliterate the house tonight trying to find where we put these things. Alright. <sighs> Back to the game at hand. As you can see, there's that guy. He's in our way. He's in the way of an ice, uh, thing. Oh, god damn it. Oh, okay, good. It did. It did go. Alright. Now, we could go over there, however... Oh, I want that. Oh. However, it is, uh... Well, there, there are things here that we have to be very careful when jumping up. God, Link has way more balls than I do. I'd cry trying to do this. I also have a very legitimate fear of heights, but whatever. Link can just jump off things. Look at this. He doesn't care. How? God. Okay. I think these boxes contain some, um, magic powder, and I need that. No, they contain rupees. I could use those, though. I will need I will need more money to beat this game. So yeah, that's my, uh, night tonight. And I cannot wait. <laughs> they, they've been, like, me and... Uh, mom, mom and my dad have been, like, bugging me constantly. Like, you need to get a job. You you need to go and apply to, like, ten places a day. And I'm like, not that many places are hiring, and I'm not going to get a job by just applying to every single freaking place. Like, well, apply to every place. Ever. 
like 20 times a day, and I'm like, oh my god. So, I finally get one, and because Mom has never given me a thing and loses everything, I can't find it, allow me to whine for the rest of the episode. Alright, so here we are, up on the third floor, I believe. Well, technically fourth, because there's a basement. There is no, uh... There's no thing here, so I have to be very careful with this. I don't think I've ever actually fallen off. Oh god, first time for everything. Hey! I forgot I was supposed to do something! Freaking A! Alright, where's the small key? Okay, I'm getting that. Okay, roll again. Small bank, reach the locked door. Use your small key. Where do I get the small key? Frick. Where do I get a small key? Oh, right! I know where I get a small key. I have to jump. <laughs> Might as well jump! Go ahead and jump. Oh my god, I would... I would freaking sob. <laughs> that is so terrifying. I'm so sorry, Link. He's only a kid. I'm just a kid. Oh my god, that song. I used to love that song, but now I think it's dumb. And life is a nightmare! Let's go ahead and, uh, go into this room, because these guys, we must murder them. They have called us pain in the past, and now they must suffer. Also, we can get it past here. Hey, buddy! There's the small key I missed! I might as well talk while I'm going back up. I guess it's not that far away. I can literally just, like, take a shortcut in the next room, so I don't have to go into this stupid, like, boomerang room. Or... <laughs> I don't know why the first thought in my mind was to call it a boomerang room. I mean, I, you gotta, like, go around a lot in order to get through it. It's the, it's the one with the switches that you gotta pound as a Goron, is what I'm meaning. That is the boomerang room to me. How did this freeze up that quickly? Come on. Alright. We're basically already there again. Whoops. Oh god, that nearly made me fly off. Then I would have probably done a jump cut, actually. I don't know if people are liking jump cuts. I've been doing those more with this series. I don't do them with, like, any other series. Okay, I gotta be careful. Yay, that went well. God, wouldn't it have been terrible if I, like... Oh, hey, these guys are new. <laughs> it's an Eno. It's persistent. And it's obsessed... It's susceptible to heat. Well, yes, I would think so. so. I guess I might as well see what this looks like. Oh, it just... Oh, it does make him, like, steam. They drop arrows if you kill them with arrows. That's cool. Um, there is a thing here. I forget where. There it is. Let me go ahead and burn this fairy. That apparently didn't work. Oh, it did. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, I'm using, like, all of these items, so... Go ahead and get rid of that to put this on. Bloop. Come to me, my fairy! Alright, nearly done with the fairies. Going much better than last dungeon, where I was like, Where's this fairy? I have the freaking manual and I still don't know. Or the, the strategy guide manual. Alright, as soon as you come in here, you will be attacked. By these guys. These are... These are Lizophos, but like, different. Donalfos. I'm pretty sure I fought some of them before. Can I shoot you? No, you dodge it. Fire probably wouldn't hurt you anyway. Alright, got one of you. They're not really that difficult. Whoop! I will fight you with my fairy mask on.
Oh right, that doesn't work. As soon as you hit them, they use their flame breath. And then you gotta back away, but I'm apparently terrible at doing that. They both drop fairies every time they die, so... Yay! We only need one more fairy. Alright, I'm pretty sure that's like up to where I have read as to what to do. Oh hey, these guys. This guy again. I'm pretty sure I do extra damage to him when I'm using the fire arrows, so I, I'm going to do that because I got plenty of arrows. Where the hell is he? Oh, he's way up there! What a dick! God, this is a large room. Eat fire arrow, jerk. <laughs> Made him jump, he's like, ow! That burns! Ouch! Meow! I don't know where that came from. Alright, but you're going to want to use, uh, use arrows anyway, because that one, like, up there, Gorons cannot reach. <laughs> that was a little close to comfort. He's all the way over there. Oh, come on. Why are you always so far away? Hey, at least I hit you that time. Wait, did I? I don't even know. God. What a jerk. Okay, I'm going to have to, like, aim. Oh, you are right in front of me. What? I hit you! What the hell? I hit him that time. There we go. I'm running out of, uh, fire. There we go. That was, like, a lot more, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? It wasn't difficult. It wasn't really a difficult fight. It was like a... Obnoxious, I could say. I've noticed I really like using the word obnoxious. That's like one of my favorite words when I'm doing a Let's Play. That was obnoxious. Alright. So you kill him, and then what do you do? Five play jars get you shit. Yep. Achieve the boss free. The, the boss free! It's like a butter free, but it runs a company. I got the thing! Go ahead into this door and destroy the two stalactites. Blocking the way. Alright. Another pair. Okay, so destroyed two, blocking the way. Proceed through the exit on the west side. West side. That would be this way. Are we going back down? Oh wait, no. I think this is a new room. We haven't gone in this room, have we? I don't think so. Oh yeah, we have. We fight more Dinolfos. It's your choice whether to engage them or make your way back. Okay, yeah, we. We, we have been in here. What the hell am I talking about? Go down here. Go ahead and ignore the Enos here, because they're really not that important. I think this is like the only time we see them, too, because they are not really, like, rememberable to me. I don't remember them that well. Rememberable is not a word. Just remember that. Alright. Go ahead and uh, curl my way over here. This looks like it'll be kind of difficult from this angle. But it wasn't. Alright, proceed to the second floor. Okay, now you see how the blue stones are kind of different from the, like, the other parts of the stone pillar? We have to smash these two to lower it somewhat. That just looks hilarious to me. Okay. Now, you can you can screw yourself up here, 
But if you uh, do, you go back down and you like click the switch that opened up. You know how it goes. Um, I don't think. Wait, actually, I think I might have screwed it up already. Hold on. Okay, go back up to the level above. Well, you can smash out the top layer from the north side. You may might as well just roll back to the west side and take them both out at the same time. Oh, oh, okay, good. Yeah, so I can go over here. Yeah, all right, and smash these. All right, boom. Now you can go across. I think I can jump up. No, maybe not. <laughs> That's a little too big for Mr. Link. I like the tattoos that Goron Link has. I don't really like tattoos, though. I don't know if I've ever mentioned this. I've never, I've never been a fan of tattoos. So everyone's like, oh, cool, tattoos. What tattoos would you get? None. If I got any, it would be like a Triforce on the back of my left hand. That's just because I am the biggest dork in the world. Alright, here we are, and we can go across here, but there's a Deku flower there, so we're not going to want to do that. We, 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 we will want to do this, but we aren't going to want to do go in there. I'll do anything for love, but I won't do that. So what you gotta do... See, I'm not even looking at the strategy guide for this. <laughs> go ahead and uh, put on the Deku mask. Now, where is it? Let me take this off and go ahead and look. It's not there. Where is it? Where is it? Huh. Oh god, I nearly fell off. Okay. It's... No. Come on, I'm like looking everywhere. Okay, hold on. Let's see here. Equip the lens of truth and, and before diving into the flower and launching out. While you glide down may seem take forever, as long as your magic meter is about half full, you'll have enough power to, to, to the lens to hone in on your target. Where is it? Oh, it's two floors down. Okay, to glide down, recover the final stray fairy from within the hidden chamber. Two levels down. Okay, well, I have about full, so... I should be able to do this by going in and floating down. Question is, which direction is it? Oh. That's not what I meant to do. It's okay, I can go back up. <laughs> Let me go ahead back up. This is weird, I like, I go in here. Oh, well that's, yeah, that's like several floors down. Okay, well, hmm. It says I can just like float down, but I was just standing there. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That is not what I meant to do at all, my giant fat friend. You're fat. Eat a carrot, fatty. Okay. And Goron Link's sobs and chews on a rock. Anyway, that'll be like a com I could totally legitimately see that comic existing. Um. Okay, well, God, while the glide may seem to take forever, just deal with it. Can I turn on the. I can turn it on while going down. Okay. Okay, this is actually like really worrying. Like, I'm, I'm like, am I going to fall? Oh, I can't turn it on. Uh oh. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh no. Oh no. Where is it? I still can't see it. I'm totally going to miss this. Where the hell is it? Okay, I'm just gonna go back up. 
Oh, goodness gracious. Two levels down. Two levels down. I don't think I... Hmm. Wait a second. Oh, I actually... Oh. Oh, I can tell what when I'm on the floor that I need to go. Because, like, in the bottom right... See? Don't go... Mother trucker. <laughs> okay, see? Now we're on another floor. And on this... Okay, I needed to go down more. That's why. But I might as well go ahead and put on the, um... The lens of truth while I'm doing it. I'm pretty sure you can see, like, where it is. Because I'm pretty sure there's, like... Uh some a, a little like sign that it's here because otherwise that would be complete BS and it might make people wonder why this flower is here oh frick I forgot to do it okay turn on this I need I, I'm afraid I'm going to run out of magic but I don't think I will do anything for love but I won't do that God, this is going to take forever. Does it go faster if I float around? It's like, oh, there it is! Okay. It's just going to take a year and a half. Da, 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 dum. Dum, 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 dum. Da, 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 dum. Dum, dum. Dum dum, da 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 dum, dum dum, dum dum, da 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 dum, dum dum, dum dum, da 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 da. Oh my God! Hurry up! I can't stretch out this horrible joke long enough. Hey guys, have you ever just been like floating on a leaf, hoping that it would hurry up? Yeah, me neither. Because those are flowers. <laughs> Hello, I'm Marzen. I am mentally incapable of naming things correctly. The thing he's wearing are pants. <sighs> Might as well look around in my room and try and find some comedy. I'm sitting next to- god dang, I have so many books. My mom wants me to take out, like, I have two bookshelves in my room, right? They're completely full of books. She's like, you don't need two bookshelves. We can just cram all the books on one shelf, and you don't need two bookshelves. I'm like, have you seen my bookshelf? Apparently you have not, because there's no room on that bookshelf. She's like, no, we, there's like a few, there's a little bit of room. We can take out some books. I'm like, no, obviously you've never seen my bookshelf. Goodness. Thank you, Lord. That took a while. It's about to be night of the 15th day. I found all the stray fairies. Alright, how do I get up? It's this way, right? Okay, at least I, at least I can get up relatively quickly. Relatively easily, too. Wow. Alright, but we're almost done with this battle. Oh, I think I need some, uh, yeah, I totally need some magic power. I can't get over this without magic power, so. Whee! I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I, I, I did need to use that magic power, though, because I seriously would not have been able to find it otherwise. Um. Whew, that was a little close. A little slippery. Okay, do you have some magic power for me? Snowballs? No. Do you have some magic power for me, icicles? No, but you have rupees. Ow. No, but you have a heart. Have a heart, buddy. I will punch you. I will deck you so hard. Don't even try me. Snowball fight! My hand is shaped like a snowball when it swings. That counts, right? I have been in here a day. That's pretty damn bad for a uh, for for a song of a slowed down song of time game. Like, 
if I was playing this quote unquote legitimately and I wasn't using the song of double time, oh god, then I would have probably gamed over by now. Because I would have been in here two days. But that's okay, because there I mean there's some stuff I gotta do on the third day, so. And I can always just come back in here and kill the final boss relatively easily by just teleporting. I don't have to redo any of the stupid stuff I did with the Goron Elder. Alright! What time are we at? But that would have given me great. That oh wait, I wouldn't have been able to get over here anyway, so that's all good. What time are we at? We're at 25 minutes. Okay, I'll kill the boss, then I'll be done. Seems like someone already killed the boss, and that someone was Weather. Well, I can take care of that. I don't know why I'd want to, but I can take care of that. Okay, now here's an interesting tidbit about this game. Watch the following cutscene. Consider the following. That doesn't do any damage. That also is not in other versions of this game. In the, uh, in the Japanese version of this game, Goat does not run you over. So it was added for the American release. I love it when people do that. That's so stupid. Okay, so basically we gotta ram this guy. Okay, I'm running out of magic power. Gotta run into the magical pots. Ow. The falling debris got me. Oh, I think he's about to, like, come up and hit me from behind. Oh, no, he's just waiting for me. What a nice guy. Okay. This boss is kind of easy. He's not that difficult. All you gotta do is just ram him like this. It's actually kind of fun. But also another thing about that cutscene I forgot to mention, that happens every time you fight him. Like, I can fight I can fight the other guy, you know. I can, I can fight the bosses multiple times just by going back in time. What am I doing to Goat? Oh god. But I can kill... I, I can kill guys, like, multiple times. And every time I go in this boss battle, he's always frozen. And I always gotta unfreeze him. And every time I do, he rams me over. You would think Link would freaking realize. Like, oh, maybe I shouldn't stand in the way every single time. Maybe I should, like, stand off to the side. Even if you are, like, standing off to the side before you unfreeze him, you won't be when the cutscene starts. It's stupid. But it's a nice little tidbit. Some information for you, courtesy of Marzen64. Let's ram the ram here. He should be almost done. God, he's going fast. Slow down, buddy. He's smoking too, he's a mechanical bull. There we go! I like his mask, just like, nerf. Boom! Dang, so much explosions, it's a freaking slowdown of the Nintendo 64. Goodness. Alright, let's go find where he crashed. Heart piece! Oh, I got a heart container. Alright, and here's Goat. You've seized Goat's remains. You have just freed the innocent spirit that this dark mask had kept imprisoned within the body of evil Goat. Or Got. Whatever you want to call him. I call him Goat because guess what? That's what he is. <laughs> oh god. What exactly are all of you? Guardians. Guardians? 
So, you're protective gods. That's why you're in the temples. But why are the protective gods... No, wait! Are you listening to me? Hey, wait! So, the, the giants, of which there should be four, are protective gods. Interesting. Oh, he's freezing. His brother froze up again. That's unfortunate. Hey. It's spring! The snow stopped. That was very quick! <laughs> spring shouldn't come that quickly. Like, God, what do we do? Like, throw the sun at the planet? We have freed Stonehead from its evil rule of snow. Huzzah! Uh. Hey there! That is a frog! I didn't actually save that guy who was up there, did I? Is he still there? No, that's gone. Yeah, I gotta do that later, I think. I don't think I saved him, did I? Do I have the mask? I do not have that mask. Okay, I'll have to do that later. So, uh, what time are we at? Yeah, it's 30 minutes, and I didn't do any jump cutting in this episode, surprisingly. So, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time for more Let's Play Majora's Mask. See you all then.